everyone's here except for Grant. Grant is in bed. <clears throat> uh, let's head outside. <laughs> clean up the landmines. <clears throat> I'm sorry if I cough or I have to clear my throat. I've been sick. If you've seen on my uh, community page or on the Facebook page, I've been sick dealing with a bad sinus infection. Um, I do not know if it was cold. Yes. It's kind of kind of warm today, so Miggy wants to play ball. <laughs> okay, right. Well, I can't kick it out there because there's a skating rink right there. Miggy, can you guys see the ice? I can't kick it that way or else he'll slide. There we go. <laughs> All the snow, all that snow we had from the one storm <clears throat> uh, pretty much melted in one day. It got up to 50 degrees <clears throat> and it made a huge uh, puddle right there because previous owners, when their children were smaller, had a pool and they dug that out uh, for the pool, kind of like a deep end in the pool. And um, so there's a slope there. Milo. Um, <coughs> oh. So, yeah. And then after everything melted, we got like four more inches of snow. And then yesterday it got up pretty warm and it's all melting again. So, uh, I don't know how long it's going to take for the water to go away. It's in the middle there. It's a couple in inches deep. So, like I was seeing, I don't know. Um, <coughs> If we had COVID or not, my husband was sick the week before me. He went to the doctor um, three days in, did not feeling well, and they tested him and they said he did not have COVID, just a sinus infection. Um, and me, I never went to the doctor. <laughs> I never went. Today's, um, I think about day six, six, sorry, not sick. Day six of since I've been sick, and I'm starting to feel better. I'd say I'm about 40% better. Um, I never got anything in my chest or anything, just all in my head. And boy, was it horrible. Um, like I said in one of my toes, my eyes, my cheekbones, and my teeth even hurt. <laughs> it was terrible. Um, so... Um, but I am starting to feel a little better, so I'm going to um, try to um, clean up the house some. Sorry, I'm rubbing my eyes. Clean up the house some <clears throat> until I just feel like I can't anymore. And I need to, like, get all the um, my bedding washed, um, spray disinfect everything in the bedroom in case I mean, my daughter hasn't gotten sick she she is vaccinated um so um i stayed home we all stayed home while we were sick we didn't go around anyone um but since my daughter is vaccinated um her job now if you're around someone who who may have it or does have it which my husband tested negative um she doesn't have to um, stay home from work unless she starts showing symptoms and she's vaccinated. So um, <clears throat> I don't think it was COVID, but who knows? Because I told my husband, everybody says, well, his test could have been a uh, could have been wrong. Um, that some people have had to get tested twice and then they find out they have it. I don't know. It's it's all crazy. So anyways, I am feeling better. Um, which is a good thing. I'm happy because I can't stand laying in bed. <laughs> I just can't. I, I was just laying there thinking, oh my goodness, I need to do this. I need to do that. Um, everything's going to be so behind. Which my husband and my daughter helped out with the boys. 
and helped out, but they work full-time jobs, so um, they can't get everything done that I like to get done. Um, Cause I'm a neat freak and I'm kind of OCD. So, <laughs> anyways, um, I just wanted to share uh, the boys a little bit. Grant's sleeping. Um, I just wanted to share the boys a little bit. Maybe when I go in, I'll take some video, of Grant. Um, but I just wanted to come in and check in. Uh, come on and check in. Can't think straight still. I guess. I guess that part um, is it isn't doing good. You're peeing on my box over there. You're gonna pee on my box. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to check in for those who uh, don't look at the community page on YouTube or <coughs> who don't um, have, have a Facebook. Um, let you know we're all still doing good. We're all still alive. Tomorrow I have to take Miggy to the vet because he's getting blood work done because he's going to get his teeth cleaned. And then uh, I have to make an appointment uh for magnum towards the end of march um i'm gonna get his teeth cleaned too so hoping to get four of the boys teeth cleaned um this year maybe five we will see how it goes so miggy and magnum are up first uh with getting teeth cleanings yes everybody's gonna pee over there by my box <laughs> You guys are bad boys. All right. We'll talk to you guys again soon. Um, maybe in a couple days. Um, hopefully, I'll be 100% by then. Yes, hopefully. All right, guys. We'll talk to you. Oh, no. I was going to videotape Grant. I'm going to videotape Grant after I pick up these landmines. I thought I'd show you the house. It's not too bad. Um, I need to clean the floors really bad. Um cleaned the boys faces um <laughs> the other day and that i shouldn't have <laughs> that wore me out just cleaning their faces yes it did um and i haven't put their collars back on them <laughs> um out here stays pretty tidy because um we just usually aren't out in this area too much what are you guys looking at <clears throat> my daughter bought me some um, flowers over here for my birthday. Looks like these are about to bloom. Um, let's go see. I'm doing some laundry. Oh. Yes, we're doing some laundry. Getting, oh. getting the bedding all cleaned up. Oh. This room's pretty good. Look at, I got Mozzie's chair back out here. Hey, what's going on? Why are you telling Marley off? <laughs> I picked up all the do I picked up all the dog toys um, last night. So this just needs to be uh, vacuumed and wiped down. Let's go see. If, let's go see what Mr. Grant's doing. Yes, let's go see. There's Kitten. There's Kitten over there. Bathroom needs to be cleaned. I got the bedroom done. There he is. There's Grant. He says, what's going on? Why are you guys waking me up? Why are you waking me up? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I got the bed, I, well, I got a pile of laundry there. Um, but I changed the bedding, wiped everything down. Let me tell you what, guys, this stuff here, Aquaphor, this has been a life changer for my nose. My nose was so sore from wiping it. Um, get this for your nose if you have a bad cold. <laughs> yes, my nose was so sore in that. Um, has made my nose feel the end of my nose feel normal again yes it has all right guys just wanted to share mr grant yep there he is he looks a little he seems a little dazed and confused because we woke him up he's like what's going on is it lunchtime i don't think so i don't think it's lunchtime <laughs> all right i put my pillows up there because i don't want the dogs laying on them and my other pillow is in my daughter's room. She stole it. 
<laughs> I've only got one pillow for the boys up there. Yeah. I'm washing the heated blanket for them right now. All right, guys, I'm going to stop rambling. Um, and uh, we will talk to you guys again soon. Yes. Yes, we will. Won't we, Magnum? Yes. So I thought I'd hop back on and um, explain why I did not go to the doctor. Because I'm sure when I told you in the first clip that I never went to the doctor, I'm sure a lot of you were screaming at me. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of you were screaming, why didn't you go to the doctor? Well, like I said, my husband went to the doctor and they told him it was just a sinus infection and they prescribed him nothing. They told him to go home, rest, take over the counter meds and um, drink fluid and uh, it should pass within a, a week. <clears throat> so... Once I started getting sick, I thought, well, they're not going to do anything for me anyway. So, <laughs> and they told my husband he didn't have COVID. So I'm just assuming that's not what's wrong with me. Um, since I got sick pretty much after him. Uh, so that's why I did not go to the doctor. And, uh, yeah. So I just wanted to explain that for all of you who are yelling at the screen to me. <laughs> why I didn't go to the doctor. Um, and I also wanted to thank everyone, um, for the birthday wishes to everyone who sent me birthday cards. Um, I do have to show you the gift that Emily sent me. I have to show you guys. It's so cool. Um, so I'll get that here in a minute, but thank you, Linda, to Mr. and Mrs. Peck for sending me a birthday card with a gift. Um, I appreciate it. And to all the other people who sent me cards, I'll get those out too and share them when I get Emily's gift out. Um. Uh, Paul, who sent me a Valentine's card. Thank you so much. Um, someone else sent me a Valentine's Day card, I think. Yeah, I'm going to get all that stuff out and share it before I end this video. So, um, just wanted to explain why I didn't go to the, um, <clears throat> why I didn't go to the doctor. So, all right, guys, I wanted to share, um, <clears throat> what I got in the mail. Since our last video, I'm trying to clean off my glasses real quick so I can read who the cards were from. <laughs> my eyes have been very sensitive uh, since being sick. So I'm glad the snow's melting because when that sun would shine on the, the white snow, oh my goodness, the glare was just impossible when my eyes were sore. So um, I'm happy the snow is melting so much. <laughs> Supposed to get some rain and possible ice tonight, though. Lovely. All right. Enough cleaning the glasses. First, I want to show you what Emily sent me. Look at this to put on our fence. Isn't this awesome? I guess I don't need to turn it this way because what can you really see that way? <laughs> oh, my goodness. I just love it. And she sent some money, too, so I can buy some flowers this spring to hang on it. So now the hard part is deciding where do I want to hang this? Yes, I love it. Thank you, Emily. Okay, here's some cards I got. Uh, I think these were the Valentine cards here. Oh no, this is birthday. So here's the Valentine card I got from Paul. And you, uh, and it sits out like this. Isn't this cute? Thank you, Paul. Love it. I had it sitting out for Valentine's Day. And then I got this birthday card. And this is from Anne. Thank you, Anne. It's so cute. And then this birthday card is from Allie in Ontario. And then you open it up. Isn't that cute? <laughs> you guys find the best cards. Yes, you do. Thank you, Allie. And then this one is from Cheryl from Cheryl's Country Home, her YouTube channel. Thank you, Cheryl, for the birthday card. Um, this is from Linda, Skip, and Dusty. And they sent a birthday gift inside too. Thank you, guys. Uh, and then this birthday card is from Peggy, Davey, and 
Wolney, W-O-L-N-Y. Um, and it says there is a box on the way. Um, there's the birthday card. <clears throat> and then this is the birthday card that came with the um, gift from Emily. Isn't it cute? Love it. So, <coughs> excuse me, guys. So, I'm almost done cleaning the house. Hooray. <laughs> um, I'm getting through the day okay. I've had to sit down and take some breaks. Um, let me get the phone. Hold on. Yep, I've had to um, sit down, take some breaks. Um, I'm still doing some laundry. I'm washing all the dog beds right now. Um, but I've got everything done except for this area here where the couches are in the dining room. So I'm working my way that way. But first, I'm making an easy dinner. Some hamburger helper, uh, the beef stroganoff, and then I'm going to make some um, red lobster biscuits to go with it. So easy dinner. I haven't cooked since I got <laughs> sick. So um, I figured I'm going with something easy today, but everything's clean, smelling nice. I'm excited, but I know I'm going to be very tired tonight, but um, I'm feeling a lot better. A um, lot better. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you. <laughs> I prayed so hard last night that I would feel better. So um, all right, guys, I'm going to get going. I'm going to finish up dinner and we'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.